ukawa is uh, the name uh, suggests uh, umoja wa katiba ya wananchi uh, which was the result of uh, supporting the uh, constitutional draft uh, of uh, Judge Warioba and uh, his commission. And uh, the basis, therefore, of uh, coming together mm. were the principles that were in this draft constitution, mm -hmm. uh, particularly the issues of um, emphasizing uh, integrity, uh, transparency, uh, accountability uh, in, uh, in public affairs and the way uh, the government is run. Those were key principles mm. that brought us together. And then when Loasa was in the Constituent Assembly, he never supported the draft, uh, the Warioba draft. He, he was not really uh, in the in the uh, uh, debate, he did not participate in the debate, he supported the position uh, of uh, CCM oh. and therefore uh, for myself it was very very embarrassing when we ended up having uh, having uh, Ed Edelas as our presidential candidate under the umbrella of Okawa. If we have to get someone from CCM to join us and be a presidential candidate in case we do not agree among ourselves. Uh, I was actually considering Judge Warioba mm -hmm. to be the appropriate candidate uh, because uh, he stood for uh, key principles. And uh, I had I went to, to, to discuss with him. I was not uh, discussing with him uh, on behalf of Kawa. I went just uh, to see what his uh, ideas and views are. And uh, I did raise the possibility of him being, being a candidate of Okawa. Mm -hmm. He's told me that, well, first of all, I've resigned from active politics from uh, 2002. I do some work when I'm asked, but I'm not uh, in active politics. But secondly, I'm still a member uh, of uh, CCM. So for me uh, to come again and say uh, that uh, uh, Edward Loas is going to be our, our, our candidate was uh, really a major setback. Within Ukawa, I, I was one of the potential candidates and uh, Dr. Sila was another one. And there was also uh, a third one, uh, Dr. George uh, from, uh, from uh, NCC Armageuzi. Mm -hmm. uh, because we didn't have an agreement as to who is going to be the candidate, we had a meeting and in fact it was a private meeting at my home. Mm -hmm. We discussed the issues. And we agreed that, well, under these circumstances, uh, uh, Dr. Slash should be our candidate. So we had agreed among the three of us who were the potential presidential candidates yeah. that Dr. Slash will be the candidate to end up with Edward Loasa as the candidate of Ukawa. Uh, it became something which was so difficult for me to swallow, then I just uh, decided that, well, I have to step aside. And also the experience that we had, mm -hmm. uh, we had uh, in terms of uh, competing the elections, mm -hmm. uh, we had decided that uh, some constituencies we should uh, leave for uh, mm -hmm. SSCF to put in a candidate. And uh, uh, in many cases, uh, for example, Segirea, which is uh, in Dar es Salaam, mm -hmm. which our former Deputy Secretary General became a candidate, but uh, uh, Chadema also had a uh, a candidate there in the ballot. Mm -hmm. uh, similarly, many other places in in, uh, in Quimba, in Sumve, that is in uh, uh, Mwanza region. Mm -hmm. uh, so you have a uh, situation where there's no longer any trust. I do not see uh, that we can uh, continue uh, this way. At, at the same time, we have uh, lost uh, the major position we had. Uh, mm -hmm. our, our moral authority was uh, in fighting corruption, in um, uh, having transparency in public affairs, uh, uh, in having integrity uh, in public affairs. And by admitting that uh, we became so opportunistic, mm -hmm. we lost uh, uh, this particular authority, moral authority, moral ground, which we stood that this is a, 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 a united front uh, to promote integrity, promote transparency, to promote accountability in our political system.